going so I'm back today with another wig Wednesday video so in today's video I'll be showing you guys a unit that I created myself and the hair was provided from lobbyhair.com now I've previously worked with lobbyhair.com and I will insert down below um, a video that I did for them I had I reviewed the Malaysian natural wave hair for them and I even showed you guys what it looked like when I colored it after so it was kind of like a double take with that hair you could have a black or you could have a blonde and I absolutely love that hair quality it just took bleach really well it kept the style and it was just it was just everything so I agreed to work with this company again so this hair that I'm showing you guys today is their Brazilian straight hair now they have the premium quality hair now they sent me three bundles of 18 inches and then a 16 inch frontal I only used two bundles just because with the frontal you actually it actually takes a little bit more space on the wig cap so therefore you don't have to add that much hair and I didn't want this unit to be too bulky so I just kind of like did single tracks but kept them tight together so that I didn't have too much of a bulky back so um, this wig pre lays pretty flat now I really like the frontal because the frontal looks very realistic even without a cap it looks really realistic guys um, it does have a great hairline and also has great baby hairs in the front so I'm going to glue this one down to show you guys what it looks like so that I can show you guys the style that I want to do with it um, so that it's not always like the middle part or side part that I'd be rocking because that's just my thing hence my hair today um, and I will link down this hair down below for you guys too because you guys ask me about this wig all the time this is one of my favorite hairstyles right here it's just it's perfect for the summertime so I'd be rocking this one all the time now um, this unit guys I love the hair the hair texture is very nice it's in between a silky and a yakky texture so you definitely get like a little bit of oomph with it I will do a styling tutorial with this one like maybe how I curl it how it you know something really good so I can show you guys what it does with a styling tool versus just wearing it straight because I definitely think that this one has potential like I said it's 18 inches long so it's not super duper long but it's it's long enough um, for the summertime so it's one of those hairstyles you can wear for the summer so what I'm going to do is got to be glue this baby down and I'm going to style and show you guys what it looks like now if you guys are interested in seeing what this unit looks like today I would like you to stay tuned and keep on watching this hair I've been taking selfies on snap Instagram story I'm just loving it loving loving it. now obviously I've laid the hair down with the got to be glue method I do need to go and buy some more because I had to cut it because I'm running out but girl I am feeling so 90s in this cute little hairstyle now this isn't like the largest density just for the simple fact that I didn't put all the bundles but I feel like this is enough to be like a realistic look like it looks so natural and so realistic like like, you can't tell me this is not cute. Like, and I usually, and this I'm going to say is I usually don't do hairstyle like this. I usually do like a side part, middle part, keep it real boring and stuff like that. But I wanted to try this one with this hair just because the hair texture was pretty. And I was like, okay, you know, let me do like a little up, half up, half down type of look for you guys. Just because I was just like, wow. Now, this is really nice, guys. I did not get any shedding from the hair thus far when I ran my strainer through it. No tangling whatsoever in the nape ear. None of that kind of stuff. Then again, it is straight hair, so you won't really see too much of that problem going on. Um, I do love the frontal. Like I said, I had to um, cut the baby hairs around and kind of like make it 
molded into Dom style. I'm really not like crazy, crazy, crazy about baby hairs like that, but for this hairstyle, I thought that it would look cute with like the whole 90s look, doing like the hoop earrings and the baby hair. So I really think that this is fleeky AF. Just tell me what you guys think down below. This is not one of the hairstyles I would go, go for, just cause I'm kind of boring when it comes to weaves and wigs, but this one, bitch, this is it. Like, th this is cute. Like, oh, wait, let me just, Oh my God, like it's just, it's just there. So I'm really excited about this one. I'm so happy that I made it into this look. Um, I think it would look cute with a middle part, side part, whatever, but if you're just trying to do extra stuff, trying to be, do a lot of different things, you can even do like those two little top knot things that I did in my last video. I think it would look, just look so cute with this and I'm really feeling this. The density is like perfect to the point that it looks realistic. So yes, I'm really excited. I really like this guy. So don't forget guys to leave your comments down below. Thumbs up this video. Video, share this video and subscribe if you haven't already and I will catch you guys later on another wig Wednesday and another fashion Fridays bye guys